too many shots in there. If I go and play nine and hit 36 shots, you know, you can get that in. There's no guarantee of that. <laughs> um, these two home games, obviously, obviously well, you won them both, so there's a bottom line aspect to that and everything. Did you uh, accomplish some other things you wanted to, or did you see uh, where you need to go to work on before the conference? Uh, getting the starts? You know, I, I think today, um, I thought the first half we played we played pretty well for, for most of the time. I thought we were really unselfish. We turned it over a little too much uh, to start the game, but, but I thought we were really unselfish. Uh, with basketball, and the guys stepped up uh, and made shots, which was good, good to see. I thought the second half, uh, you know, give Little George credit. I thought they, I thought they came out and really played hard and competed. And I thought we were probably too unselfish in the second half. We had a number of possessions where, uh, you know, we, we get a paint touch, kick out, and then we, and then we drive it again. And, and we needed, we needed the shot to be taken. Um, and so it's just an area of when, when kind of things, you know, momentum shifts a little bit. Uh, our guys are they're trying to play right, but, but you got to have you got to have some have some courage to, to step up and shoot it when uh, when our winning team needs to. And we just kind of kept driving it and driving it, and, and the guys in, in trouble a uh, bunch. Are they searching for a balance in games like this between maybe the tentative way you're talking about tonight and what happened against Western Carolina, where they probably shot too soon in the in the shot clock and, and maybe didn't work it enough. No, I, mean, yeah, no they, I don't think so. Are they trying to figure that out? No, I just think we, um, I think we had some opportunities that, that we missed and guys were trying to, you know, you, guys are trying to make the 100% shot, like, okay, I'll drive this again and we'll get an even, an even better shot. Uh, whereas, you know, we, we probably take the first one, that's a really good one, because uh, the paint gets occupied and there's a massive humanity. Um, so, you know, just got to continue to get better and then have guys. And we may need to look at the lineup. I think we might have got a couple lineups in there where we might have two main drivers. And, and not enough guys that are comfortable shooting. Uh, Those guys look like they're better than they were last year. Better team, Middle Georgia. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember. Um, but I'll tell you this, I think Coach Mo does a really good job. Um, I've got a lot of respect for, for him, the way he coaches his team, and the way they play. Okay. And uh, now you go a couple of, a couple of tough road games. Yeah, yeah, it's a big week Come for around. us. It's a big week for us. We've got a, a hopefully we have a better couple of days of practice. You know, coming out of exams. Um, hopefully, we have a couple of good days of practice, and then and then go out and perform well on the road. Okay. Uh, and then you're, uh, uh, but you know, last week and this week had exams in between, right? Exams were all this past week. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So uh, even though you had a couple of home games and you had a break, it wasn't a mental break because they had to. Right. Had to deal with it. Well, I think this, especially with young guys. Yeah, yeah, especially with young guys, um, as they as they go through it, you know, that they're, they being able to compartmentalize um, is a challenge. And you know, I'm not so sure that we necessarily handled it as well as we could throughout the entire week and then throughout the entire game. Now, um, exam week, how many practices do you get? Uh, let's see. We practice Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Okay. Yeah. But normally, would you, if you had, would you go every day? Yeah, maybe four or five. Yeah. But you don't get as much practices. No, you generally, you generally will give them some time off at the beginning of the week just to mm -hmm. um, kind of prepare to hopefully do well academically. Okay. What you, and uh, finally, what are you looking for the most? You know, four games until the conference schedule starts, or three, three. What do you want to see out of these these three games that's going to get you ready for conference? Yeah, I think consistent effort. Uh, on both ends of the floor for for longer periods of time. You know, what I mean, I think we I think we've proven to this point that uh, in in segments we can be really really good defensively, uh, and I think we've done the same. We we'll continue to grow offensively, but just seeing if we can't if we can't continue to uh, stretch those into longer and longer periods, taking care of the basketball, uh, rebounding the basketball um, as we go.